So we are talking about value today. So value in art is light and dark. And what I would like you to do is pick one color of either crayon or oil pastel. And we're going to practice making some different values with it. So let me just demonstrate first of all that if you take this and you don't push very hard while you're drawing, I'm being real gentle, real light, then you can see that the purple on my paper is pretty light. But if I push really hard, you can see that the purple on my paper is pretty dark. And then if I'm kind of in between, I can make something that's in between, not too light and not too dark. So we're going to use that same idea to draw a stack of ice cream cones. And we're going to make the ones on the bottom dark and the ones on the top lighter. Let me see. Let me make sure you can see my whole paper here. All right, so I'm going to start with the top. So I'm going to do a big curvy line like this to be the top of my ice cream cone. And then I'm going to do a bumpy line on the bottom that curves around to be the bottom of the ice cream cone. And now, like I said, this is a stack of ice cream. So I'm going to do another cone, I mean another scoop. That's the word I was looking for, another scoop underneath it. So I'm just doing two curvy lines and then a bumpy line. And then I'm going to do two curvy lines again and a bumpy line and then two more curvy lines and one more bumpy line. All right, then for the bottom, I need to make the cone. So I'm going to make a V. I'm going to start right down here and go down and then up. And I could make some lines on my ice cream cone, some diagonal lines that go this way and then some diagonal lines that go the other way so it looks more like an ice cream cone. All right, now I am going to color the ice cream. So I'm going to start from the bottom and I'm going to push really, really hard to make this a very dark value. So I'm pushing down real hard to color in this bottom ice cream cone really dark. It shakes my camera a little bit because I'm pushing really, really hard to make this as dark as I can. I'm going in circles at the bottom when I do the bumpy parts. All right, so there's my very dark value. All right, then I want to make the next one kind of medium. So I'm just going to kind of do normal pressure. So instead of pushing down real hard, I'm still pushing down a little bit but not as much because I want this one to be a little bit lighter in value than the one that is underneath it. And then for this one, I'm going to do real light so that it's just barely purple at all. So I'm not pushing down, I'm being real gentle. All right, so then you can see the top one I'm going to leave white so it's real light and then a little bit darker, a little bit darker, and a lot darker, depending on the value that I used. Now, after this, you can decorate however you want to. I'm going to grab another color real quick here. I think maybe I'll put a cherry on top of my ice cream cone. Oop, you can't see the top of it. Um, maybe if I have more colors, I could do sprinkles. I could color in the cone. I could draw things around it. You can finish this drawing however you want to. Just show me the value on the cones.